One of the challenges you have as a school district is how do you authentically engage with the public? It's not an easy thing to do. I love the idea of geolocating the parents so we could see who was involved in the conversation and I liked uh, you know, the authentication as a way of knowing that it wasn't so anonymous that we could actually be talking to people that we could identify and say, oh, you know, what are your thoughts about this? And so it just seemed more, more authentic, more whole. It's a big deal because uh, we live in the world of social media where uh, anonymity seems to empower people to say whatever they think. And once, I feel once you get to know people uh, and you can put a name to a face or vice versa, you actually get a more robust conversation and a better conversation. And um, you hold people, uh, for lack of a better word, accountable for their conversation. We absolutely want to hear our critics and uh, we want to hear all of honest, the honest and direct feedback. But I always feel a first a step in uh, having your voice be heard is take responsibility for who you are. And in Surrey, we have so many different needs on capital. Um, we just need to have a multifaceted approach for engaging with the public. There will never, I would argue there will never be a replacement for face to face, but we should be using modern tools as part of our repertoire. I was looking for parents to get engaged, to use it. Um, and I was looking for parents to start communicating to us in a really wholesome way online, which they did. I was very happy with the results and it really helped policy and it really help, has helped in subsequent conversations. Let's take boundary moves. Um, it really is important for us to know who's contributing the conversation because you want to know if the feedback you're receiving says, um, go ahead, change that boundary, but the people who are contributing are from outside the boundary, well then I don't want to say they don't have any input, but it's, it, there, you really aren't hearing from the people who are most affected. And the geolocation allows you to add another layer where you can see whether the people who are being most impacted by the discussion are the ones contributing. And again, that's not to be exclusive of the others, but it should weigh in your consultation around, well, who is speaking? How do you help the public understand where you are actually going strategically as a district? We had a lot of uh, input into capital and our need for more buildings in Surrey. And so we wanted to put our entire capital plan online to help the public understand um, just what are our plans, why are these our plans, how do you go through the process of building a school, um, why does it take so long, how do you get funding. So rather than have it be a static web page on our hub, we call it the Hub, the Surrey School website. We wanted a more interactive page where we could also open discussions related to the capital plan. So you know, I said to the Board of Education, I want our capital plan to be alive, to be interactive, and Play Speaks one way that we can host that. Some parents, you know, are less inclined to want to authenticate. They find that a new thing. Like, why can't I just, you know, why are, they would say to us, why are you making it so hard to contribute? Because you actually have to take a couple steps. And we would say that those steps are really important in terms of um, you know, standing up, saying who you are, and letting your voice be heard. It's worth taking the moment to authenticate. Uh, and it also decreases when I say to you early, we've had, in the end of the day, we've had to do very little moderation of comments. I think that's a testament to, we just don't let people sign in anonymously and say whatever you feel. Um, I just, I'm just not supportive of that. And again, I'm not trying to shut people down, but I think you should take responsibility for what you say. And I know that we have uh, pieces of PlaySpeak that we could do more with, and I'm ready to explore those and see what it can bring.